you guys. <laughs> What's up? It's your girl Tanya. Welcome to Katora Terror. Guys, please like, share, and comment. Please subscribe to the channel. Anything you'd like to know about me and this channel will be down in the description below. Also, I do this for entertainment purpose only, so take what resonates and leave the rest behind. I also want you to know that there that no weapon formed against me shall prosper. I am protected by the Most High God and my team of spiritual warriors of the highest light. My ancestors don't correct me, so please don't try it. At this moment, I like to call for our angel Michael to protect I and the collective against any negative thoughts, psychic attacks, anyone trying to come in to do anything, tricks the energy, anything. I reject that extra, extra shield of protection around I and the collective. Please and thank you. In this time, I'd like to call upon your warriors, my warriors, and the most high God to this reading so I can get clear, accurate channel messages. Please and thank you. Okay, guys, let's read this for the collective. So let's see what's going on for us. Oh, man, guys. It's been a minute since I did a collective reading. But I'm being called to do this reading, so let's do it. Let's see what's going on for us. Holy pre-shuffle, look at that. Let's see, what do Spirit have for I to collect it? Blue Moon Energy. I'm getting full meditation. I can. So, off back, Spirit, I'm here. Spirit want us to pay attention to what we're consuming, what we're eating. You know, that the food we consume. It plays a role in our powers that we have, our connection. So if you eat high vibration food, you vibe high vibration. If you eat low vibration food, you're going to buy low vibration. You're going to feel all kind of frigidity and out of pocket. But when you eat the right food, you you feel good. You know, you're able to think clearer and just be more at peace with yourself and the divine. You get to hear information coming in clearer too, Brother Mary. Yeah, you gotta add more food sources to your vegetables to your diet. I'm here fasting. Do a fruit fast, a juice fast. You can use the I can meditation because you can do it. You can put, you could do anything you put your mind to. Food you eat in plays a major role in these gifts and abilities that you're obtaining in this moment. In order to master it, you have to consume the right type of food is what I'm hearing. We have accountability and joy and light. Okay, so off back, 
I'm getting that you do take accountability for yourself or maybe in certain areas like food it's a weakness it's like a, like you take accountability to the action you put towards people or a situation you realize the fault and everything and you know where you you know you put in the extra effort into learning growing and evolving so spirit wants you to apply the same energy into the food you eat because you can take accountability for what you put inside your body you know nobody you know what they say you could force somebody you could bring somebody to the water but you can't force them to drink that water well yeah this is like um spirit is giving you all the warning signs all the signs to eat right and in so many different ways spirit is warning you about your diet and if you don't listen we have the saying in jamaica who can't hear will fail so you probably feeling some physical pain because you you got a new body you got a new cell they've been working on you that's what i'm hearing like when you go to sleep your spiritual team is over you working on you and storing new gifts new abilities new downloads is being poured upon you when you sleep so when you wake up you may feel tired and grabby and stuff if you consume the right type of food you won't feel that way when you get up and you'll be able to enjoy these new gifts and abilities better and it won't be as painful as it can be because no matter what you did the work because joy and light is out here you did it you you know you're, you won't get all the gifts and the powers and everything, you know, but it's the pain process. Spirit wants you to be as pain-free as possible. I see a child smoking the weed right here. So, you know, if you're smoking weed, you got to, you, you get the munchies. Real talk, you get the munchies, you want to eat. And, you know, the spirit is like, all right, you want to smoke your weed, you want to do that, all right, you're doing that. But when you're doing that, consume the right type of munchies. You can munch a bunch of fruits and vegetables. <laughs> That's what I'm hearing. If you don't like eating fruits and vegetables, blend that shit up and, and just make it into something that you would like. But in order for you to enjoy these new abilities that you're getting you gotta consume the right food and i know it'll be some food out there you don't want to let go of but you could do it you can do it you will do it because at some point your body gonna be like um hello <laughs> You want to speak this language that you understand right now, but do I have to speak that language for you to understand that uh, you cannot continue consuming certain food no more? Your body's rejecting it. It's going to start showing physically. Yeah. Like you won, you like leveled up to a whole new level. You like in alignment with self, with the universe. You like did the damn work. You did the thing. Now, Spirit just wants you to enjoy all the the greatness, the goodness. Enjoy where you at. Just you know. But to make it as pain free as possible, you have to cut out certain food and introduce yourself to new foods. Food that's more high vibrational, stuff that you normally don't, con don't consume, you need to start consuming it. And yeah, a lot of that is processed food. I know it could be expensive. 
And I know we so used to microwavable pop, pop, lock it, just drop, take it out of the thing and throw it in the microwave or oven and air fry it. And Spirit wants you to cook your own food right now. They want you to leave that fast food alone because a lot of these food ain't even food, real food. They also want you to grow your own food, start growing like herbs and stuff. So small, I ain't saying you gotta grow a whole field of stuff. You probably live in an apartment and don't have that, you know, ability to do a garden or stuff, but you could do like a kitchen garden, you feel me? Small, small, like little herbs like basil and thyme, rosemary and sage. No, it's um green onion. You call them scallions, bell peppers. You know strawberry. What else? I'm just hearing a lot of different foods. I'm seeing a lot of different foods. Wherever wherever you are, you could do it. Go ahead and do it. It, your your higher self will be so appreciated. Your future self is like, I'm glad you listened. You got zooted up and you paid attention. You got the assignment clearly. You did the darn thing. You listened to your intuition. And you start consuming the right type of food for your body so you can enjoy these new abilities that you, you know, that you're taking, that you you have accountability for. So in order to nurture these gifts and these abilities, you have to take accountability for them so you have to know what they are what you can and cannot do because you, you're a whole new being. You're no longer who you used to be. You got a whole new body, a whole new cell. Your DNA is not what it used to be. You know, you even had the doctors so confused is what I'm hearing. Yeah. It's like a lot of things is changing. It's already began. It's like you're waiting for a change, but it's been beginning. Because now you you at a level where, it's, where you're just joyful, love and light. You paid attention. You took accountability to your action, and you start doing what you needed to do for you. Who? Yourself. Because you know you what? You could do it. Because what, what's this thing? I can, I will. And you did. Congratulations. Spirit is very proud of you right now. They want you to take it easy on yourself. I mean, it's so hard on yourself. You just like, wanna, okay, I did that. What's next? Nah, how about enjoying and staying in that enjoyment phase right there? You so you to staying in chaos that when something great happened for you, you you know you quit to want to come up out of it and go on to the next thing and not really enjoy and marinating it like how you would marinate a meat for a few hours, few days, few weeks, depending on what you're trying to do. Spirit wants you to marinate in, in, in this is your season. This is your time. Enjoy it. You deserve it. You did the work. Stop being hard on yourself. The sun is so shining on you. You you chose the most high. The most high is very happy with you. Very happy with you. You know? You had a lot of eyes on you also. A lot of eyes is on you. And a lot of naysayers, they, they doubted the shit out of you. <laughs> they got high on talking shit about you. <laughs> they thought you was going to mount to nothing. They thought you was all talk and, and, and that was it. They didn't see your potential. Well, they seen it and just ignored it. Because they was vibing so low also, so they didn't see that 
you have this infinity built into you. Look at that. I don't know if you can see it. It's kind of dark, right? Yeah. That's the infinity A symbol right here. So you was destined to get this shit together. <laughs> you was always destined to get this shit together. You were always destined to be the best version of yourself, to get it together, to have this victory, you know, to start eating right, loving on yourself, smoking so weak, getting high, getting in tune with your star players. You are destined to, you were chosen for this. And you have people real mad, they, cause they've been spying on you. I'm getting spying energy. They've been spying on you. Got people like real mad. <laughs> look, look, as soon as I said that, look, this is the only card that's turned over in this deck. Conflict. Okay? You got at least three people wondering how the hell you did this. Like, they really, you know, try to disrupt you, disrupt your life, disrupt what they think they thought they knew of you, they don't understand you, it's always transcending, changing, growing, evolving, you're destined to bring their ass down, they saw you as a nobody, they thought you were just another runaway girl or a runaway boy, they didn't see you as a mountain to nothing but the same old story of everybody else. And you see you moving on up to nothing. And now people, they bet it or against you. And now they in conflict. Yeah. They bet it against you. Not knowing that you was always abundant and destined for this shit. <laughs> you was hidden in plain sight is what I'm hearing. You was always hidden in plain sight. These people mad because they doubted you left and right. They didn't, you know, even if they saw your potential, they just didn't see how great you can be. And if they did, they were so jealous of you that they did everything and they energetically feel to make sure that that didn't happen. But you can't stop destiny. Destiny can only be delayed. It cannot be stopped because what's for you will always be for you. And you had to learn that. And now they're learning like, why every time I paid you this and you say you was going to do this and this is going to work and I gave you this money to do this and this much and why they working and all this Everything I you you said is backfiring and why am I going through all this pain and all this suffering? Everything I wish for this person is not happening to me. Uh hello. Uh the 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 relevant effect, you know. That's what that is, cause if you have a person that's vibing very high, me ass. Vibing very high. <laughs> Very high. Eating the right food, tuned in, tapped in. Getting downloads, information from spirit. Ten step ahead of y'all. Know that y'all was gonna come with this bullshit before y'all even knew y'all was gonna come with this bullshit. Damn, what you know? <laughs> Some of y'all is seers out there, psychics. Y'all already knew. Oh my God, some of y'all mediums, y'all ancestors, y'all tuned in with y'all ancestors, y'all spirit guides, y'all communicate. Y'all been getting the downloads. Y'all know ahead of time what was up, what was going on, and these people doubted you. They're like, nah, that, per that ain't happening to that person. That's just that person. They didn't see you as you. All oh, this is happening to you. You're, you're, the, you're the chosen. You know, it's like, go watch the Matrix, yo. Know? That's what I'm hearing. The Matrix. I Me, mean, I need to go watch the Matrix again. All three parts. 
that could make sense to y'all. But <laughs> y'all gotta play by the most high. And these angels, these guys, these ancestors. Hell, even the animals play y'all. <laughs> y'all thought y'all outed some animal. <laughs> the animal knew it was always short term live. It came down here to do what it had to do. It did what it had to do, and they knew it was time to go. So if you thought you took out some animal that was always protecting this divine person right here, you didn't. That was a part of the assignment too. Yeah, because they did their job. Yeah. They did their job. They did their job. <laughs> yeah, y'all up here doing magic on cats and dogs and birds and all kinds of shit and rabbits. I'm just hearing. Y'all gonna get in trouble for all that. Remember, I told you that. God watching. Y'all gonna burn in the pits of hell. But like I said, if y'all thought y'all out of the animal and y'all got the best of that person because y'all out of the animal that was close to an individual is what I'm hearing. I'm hearing that too was a part of the assignment. You ain't out, no, you ain't win that neither. You were destined to go the way that was destined to happen the way it happened, period. Because if that person wasn't, if that animal wasn't sent here to achieve a certain goal or task, trust and believe when I tell you, you wouldn't even have a chance to out this animal because that's how powerful this animal was in disguise, spiritual protection. That's why you try to kill that animal every time because this animal kept getting in your way. You couldn't get to do what you wanted to really do. This animal helped this individual open their eyes. They was a real familiar to them. That was the ancestors, if you didn't know. Yeah, they came back down in animal form to help their loved one and you fell for the okie doke. You thought you got over. You did. That was a part of the assignment, too. <laughs> they going to get your ass in the spirit world if they did already. <laughs> Yo, y'all some ruthless, heartless motherfuckers. I'm keeping it 100 with y'all. Y'all some heartless people, y'all. I, I beg. I'm going to keep it moving. I beg. Uh, Let's get a room card, a familiar card. No, not yet, okay, not yet. But yeah, y'all got played. A lot of y'all thought y'all was smart as fuck. It's okay though. <laughs> it's okay. We all get played out here, you know? We all thought, think we, you know, we ahead of the game and we getting the best uh, 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 over on somebody or some people. It, it, not, no, it was all a part of a bigger plan. But thank you for thinking that, though. At least you know the truth now, you know? Exception is the key. It's okay. <laughs> Six plus five is what? Eleven? Eleven. Come, that's the number two. Eleven. <laughs> it's going to be all right. Hey, it's going to be all right. Some of y'all sold y'all soul. <laughs> Straight up. Some of y'all sold y'all soul. 
thinking y'all was going to out this person right here, this individual. It could be a he, it could be a she, he, she, whatever. Energy is fluid. You can search the roles. There's no gender and terror. But we're talking energy here. <clears throat> yes. Some of y'all sold your soul to the devil to, to out this person right here. It, it didn't work. You, you must be real mad right now. Yeah, clearly you're mad. You sold your soul and now you're in conflict with everyone around you. Your so-called rivals, your so-called friends are now your rivals. Because they know your secret, they know your dirty, nasty, disgusting secrets that all of y'all did together. And you mad? Because they could out your ass the same way you could out them, but hey. Now y'all fighting each other. But this is what you wanted for this individual over here. For everybody to fight this individual because you were jealous. Ungrateful son of a bitch. That's that's what this that's the energy I'm picking up. You're just jealous. There's nothing else. This person was loving light to your ass. And you couldn't understand what that was, what that meant. You know? Because why? This person must have smoked weed and looked a certain way and didn't look the way you would think somebody loving like would look some, somebody the way you envision the most high to bless with these gifts or these powers or these abilities or these abundance. Yeah, you underestimate God. That, you, that has nothing to do with this individual. That's all on you. That's all on y'all. There's multiple people out here. This is not just one person. Y'all put y'all soul. Y'all sold y'all whole soul and got shit back in, in, in return. But some of y'all, y'all been, y'all think y'all been sold y'all soul and y'all been getting over on motherfuckers for the longest. I'm cursing a lot now because this is the energy I'm picking up. Because some of y'all, Y'all sold y'all soul and been getting over doing some ungodly shit to some people for the longest, a very long time. So when this person came looking like a nobody, and they, and they smoke, like, okay. They smoke their guns and everything, and they into their garden and shit. They're just looking weird and shit like a hippie, like I'm hearing. They didn't look like a modern day, you know? They look just slow in, in, in your eyes. You know, they didn't look like, they looked just like, okay, ooh, next target, next mission. We won't get this one down. All along, this was the one to bring y'all motherfuckers down. Yeah, the spirit hit you in plain sight, like, but I'm here, it's okay, though. <laughs> Try y'all be doing the most too. All this goddamn spell work I'm seeing now. Y'all be doing the worst. I'll see some of y'all in a garden or yeah, woods or something. A bunch of y'all around in the woods trying. And if I'm seeing red and black and a little white too. And y'all sitting around, not sitting, but well, y'all standing around and y'all, it's like this big pot. And y'all just doing whatever y'all doing, saying whatever y'all chanting, looking into it and seeing what y'all seen. Y'all spying. I said, I said, I said, I was seeing spying. Motherfuckers are spying on you for the longest. I said that and I'm seeing that again clearly. Y'all been spying on this individual hard, very hard for a very long time. 
to every mood, to every little thing. Y'all got a lot of time on your hand. God damn. All that time, y'all could have been focusing on y'all. You have been focusing on the wrong damn thing, and now that's why you're in conflicts. It's going to be okay, though. <laughs> God gonna get y'all. This is an earth angel. Yeah, 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 yeah. This person was a decor. This was God sent this person here to look confirmation, to look the way they look, sound the way they sound, act the way they act, to throw y'all dumbass off. And make y'all think that y'all could get over on this person. Make y'all think, look, look, look. I'm hearing God made y'all think y'all was getting over on this person. This person was just losing out all along. This person was winning. And so y'all, God, God, God used y'all to open this person up even wider. And now this person know who they is and victory is theirs. And, and, and y'all mad. It, it's going to be okay. <laughs> Y'all mad? What y'all mad for? Because what y'all wanted for this person is not happening to y'all. Y'all got to remember, my mama always said, when you dig in a grave with somebody, make sure you dig two graves. One for you and one for them. Because what you do to them, it will come back to you. Because especially that person not do you not know no about nothing. That's a mind and business. God not going to make that person dead because of you. Especially if they was here on a decor. They had a mission the whole damn time. And now they joyful because of it. They want a mission. They did what they had to do. First level because some of them had double, triple, and quadruple mission. So you're, again, I'm getting multiple people. So... This was a big plan, a big plan, plan in the making. I'm hearing before they even enter this planet, yeah, God sent this individual here because y'all been doing the most for the longest. For the longest, y'all been getting away with ciphering people energy, stealing their money, stealing, se I'm hearing sex magic and everything. Look, look, look. Somebody don't want me to talk. They messing with my throat chakra. Well, let me tell you, like I always tell y'all, I don't work for nobody but the most high God. So this information, this message will come out. You have no power over me or anything I say or do. I know who I am. Period. So like I was saying before I got rudely interrupted. <coughs> let me drink some water to this. People like to play. But yeah. <clears throat> they mad. <laughs> they mad. Because they fell for the okie doke. And God knew they would have fell for the okie doke. Our ancestors knew they. Your ancestors on their ass, too. Look, 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 look at your ancestors. Your ancestors is on their ass. Like, yeah, go ahead. Go ahead. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Um, um. Ancestors is on somebody. Some of y'all asses. Yeah, just, come on. You can't mess with this part, this individual. This energy is very protected. Very protected. Any shit you can do, but it's but accept defeat, accept it. Now you don't want to accept that you rather be in conflict. Well, then you don't, well, you, you know, of course, you're gonna be in conflict. You sold your soul, you have no soul, no rest, no what they say, no what rest for the wicked. You're very wicked. Very wicked. But God gonna deal with y'all. I don't got nothing to say. God. 
I said, God gonna deal with y'all. Like, what came out? Come find it. <laughs> Some of y'all going to jail? Oh, shit. Some of y'all is going to jail. Yeah, y'all. Some of y'all spiritual jail and or some of y'all the street in jail. I, 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 I don't want to go to spiritual jail. I, I, I don't want to go. Do you know what goes on in the spirit world? People? Oh my God. It, it, you, you don't want to go to spiritual jail, but somebody going to spiritual jail. Some of y'all out there going to spiritual jail. Because y'all tried it. <laughs> I'm laughing because look what number came out, 56. 5 plus 6 is how much people? 9, 11. I never messed the number with. <laughs> Yo, this is the most facts. Oh my God, 11, 11 out here. This is divinely guided. This is all facts, people. Some of y'all going to spiritual jail. Some of y'all going to real jail, but that's spiritual shit. I, 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 I want no. Same way I want when I switch her ass over. It, it's not very nice. And it doesn't leave a pretty mark on your skin, your physical skin. It, it, it's very abusive, may I add. You, you, you don't want that. Trust me. <laughs> Some of y'all are headed in this right. Y'all gonna get it. Y'all gonna learn today, said the most high. See y'all ancestors, said spirit. Y'all gonna learn today. Stop the fuckery. It's what I'm hearing. Stop the fuckery. Leave people pitting you alone. Leave people pitting you alone. No, it's no. Even though the school system lied to us, certain stuff was not a lie. No means no, yes means yes. But do I mean the same thing in the underworld? Like, you know, if it's the opposite of here, okay, that's me. No, focus like with the two words. Okay. Um. <laughs> Y'all get y'all ass whooped. And y'all going to jail for it. And y'all have no soul. This is y'all karma. Karma at its finest, may I add. This is karma at its finest. I played y'all so. This is karma at its finest. Let's get a cosmic card. What's going on? Anything else? Come on, you can't, you can't expect for one. Some of y'all trying to bury somebody. Y'all went to somebody graveyard. God damn. Y'all don't want to the y'all took it to the grave. Let me tell you something about this graveyard and dirt that y'all be going. Y'all don't know who dirt and what dirt is what and who spirit you bringing back with you. Are you sure it's even the right dirt you're bringing back with the right person? Because you really got to go with deep down. You know, it, it, it's so much aspect to the dirt in the cemetery. You just don't go dig up some dirt and then bring it back and think that's it right there. That's so... Anyway, I... I, I was, that's some, yo, I ain't judging though, but I am, but I ain't, but I am, the fuck, how you expect to want to out somebody, you want, you were somebody death, but this person over here living in loving light, the fuck my, <coughs> All right, now, no bad minded and grudgeful, meaning, ain't that some jealous shit? Nobody got time for this wahala, this pasa pasa, this problem. Nobody don't want there's something there. This is not but wahala. 
problems. See the problem is this is this is where you're gonna end up. Because you don't sold your motherfucking soul to try to out an earth angel that's living in love and light even when they're going through adversity. Make it make sense, people. Just gotta pray this little piece of wag is. <laughs> Look, graduation for this eleven light person individual. Graduation. That's what that's what the conflict is about. This person done graduated to a whole new level. Your energy cannot even attack this person. This person's vibe is so high. The energy that you come with, y'all come with, y'all will get blind every time. Every time. Every time. In life, sometimes you learn some, you lose some. And that's okay. You know, like I always tell my kids, you, you we never lose and we're always winning. We're always winning. Even when you think you're losing, you're winning. Because it's a better understanding of who you are, where you came from. So that when a situation occurs again, because we're on a planet of karma, so therefore, you're going to go through it. You're going to have your ups and your downtime. So, yeah. Hold on, I need some water. Yeah, brain fog. But what I was saying, you can't want bad for somebody that's living over here wishing everyone good because you're jealous. Oh, that shit gonna come back to you because you're impatient. You couldn't wait. You didn't do the work. You didn't do the assignment. So because you didn't do the assignment, this is where you gonna end up. If you ain't already there. Mm. This is where jealous. Look, look, look. You getting a headache and all. Look at all the steam coming out your head. Yeah, you cause it on yourself. You're getting downloads. Now you have no choice but to sit with yourself. Sit with all this energy, all these thoughts and everything of everything you done did. Because while you could lie and steal and deceive and do the most outside of you, you see inside of you, you can't lie to yourself. You can't deceive yourself. You can't lie to spirit. You can't deceive spirit. So now when you in confinement, you know, because you lost, you sold your soul, got all these demons living up inside your bodies and shit, lying and shit, talking about you don't got no demon in you, lies. You got so accustomed to that lifestyle that you don't know nothing else. The spirit, spirit brought a, a, a detour and to like try to set you straight, but it ain't work. You teamed up with, with some friends, some family members to try to bring this one down. You sold your goddamn soul to try to bring this person that's living in love and light down. It ain't work. You try to bring loved ones against this person, this individual. For some of them, yeah, it did work. And now they're in conflict. And for some of y'all know it didn't work. They're like, nah, I don't know what you're talking about because I see different, I know different. Yeah, you 
you get a lot of downloads. You sitting with your thoughts. You have no choice but God suck your ass down. Clink, clink, lock down. You have no choice but to sit and think about every wrong dealing that, dealing that you did to this individual. Because this individual did not deserve it. Not one bit. You're haunted by that. You're haunted by that. That's why this confinement class is. You're very haunted by that. It's a divine masculine. I couldn't make this shit up. It's a divine uh, emperor. So it's a mastermind, a master. This is the person that's all four kings in one, okay? So they thought they was living on top of the world or harnessing off everybody, energy, everybody, power, everything. They thought it was stable, structure. People used to bow down to them for I'm the man, I'm the king. You know, this person was real press. You know, they got money. They got had luck. They had all that good shit off this energy up here. This beautiful divine energy up here. You know, this person thought it was them I'm hearing that brought all the luck. So they ill treated. They really fell for the okie doke with this person. Because they was living in this energy, this strength of her strength or his strength. Because again, energy is fluid, it's such a role as if you want, if you have to. When you pull back your power and the truth finally revealed itself, you start eating right, looking right, losing right, the, the weight or gaining the weight, whatever the story is for you. Everything start coming in alignment for this person. The truth came down yet. Yeah, she pulled back or he pulled back their energy. You know? It was an alignment. They got high one day and it was like, start hint, start talking to God, the ancestors, the source, spirit, whoever you resonate with. They happen. Was, a lot was revealed. A lot. You did a lot. A lot of ungodly things is really here. Yeah. You were you were the big you were a big fish, you know? You are the big deal in your area. You have youngins looking up to you, family members looking up to you. You could have been younger than them, they were still looking up to you. You could have been older than them, they still was looking up to you. But you, 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 you have, I'm hearing tricks the energy. Yeah, that, yeah. What about this conflict card? It's fighting with everybody. Or who you thought you hold near and dear to against this energy over here, you're not having problems with. You're fighting with them. You gotta let them go. was building with this energy. Yeah, was harnessing the, a bunch of different energies. And now you now you living in conflict. Mm. That's so y'all was in a family business of harnessing 
energy. Family could be friends, friends related, co-workers, whatever you want to consider who your family, or it can also be blood related. But you, it's like one after the other, one after the other. And look, you had them one after the other, but look at this one right here, the one that you thought was nothing, the one that you put behind you. That's always the key, the one to bring you down. And that's who brought all y'all down. Disguise. Oh, that's a dog. That's nothing. They don't do. They ain't about nothing. They don't do nothing. These over here, they got this. They got that. They look like this. They look like that. This one, she just, uh, or he just, uh, not knowing all along. Yeah, it's a disguise. Spiritual disguise is what I'm hearing. <coughs> Five on five on the clock changes here. Individual change. Okay, with that number, let's change the individuality. Mastery. Like I said, it was you and your friends, you and your entourage, you was the big fish of deck. Okay, people saw you as Eddie Murphy coming to America. Is that love is what I'm hearing? You you had it. You know, people bow down to you. You were the big fish. But what happened when Eddie came to America when he realized it wasn't what he thought it would have been. He had a what? God had to knock him down. Look at it in a, in a spiritual kind of way. God had to knock him down and he had to humble himself and get a nine-to-five job and do what he had to do in a different kind of way to obtain the riches, even though he had riches before. He had to attain riches in a different kind of way, abundance in a different kind of way, knowledge, wealth, discovery in a different kind of way, true love in a different kind of way. Got knocked down the sides, like I said. You know, some of y'all, y'all have somebody overseas that's watching y'all get more spying energy. They. They want to come in and marry you and want you to be their king to their queen, their queen to their king. And you, you some of y'all, y'all know this individual, but y'all don't know that this individual is in disguise also and got a lot of money. It's not about money, but a lot of abundance in different areas. Not just about money. Money plays a major role. Yes, money would never be a problem. <laughs> Look, they ain't want that one to come out. Money, I'm going to let it come out again. Money would never be a problem with this new relationship is what I'm hearing. Money won't even be a, a, fag, a fragment of a situationship. It's like you blink, it's there. <laughs> Literally is what I'm hearing. That's for some of y'all coming into a new relationship. I just heard that. Discovery. You're about to discover something. Something great about yourself. Something new. Something excitement. You're going to be in alignment. You deserve this. This queen deserved this. This king deserved this. Y'all been through some shit. Y'all been through hell and back. Yeah, some of y'all, yeah, 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 um, they coming out to Soil Roll Oats and whatnot, 
but they're going to end up falling in love with you for real, for real. They think they're just coming to get a little uh, 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 and keep it moving just to have that experience. But then when they come across you, you're going to come and you're going to blow them away. They're going to end up finding their true love. They, 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 they kin spouse. They divine masculine. Divine, if you're into all that twin flame business, they're going to find it. It's destined. It's here. It's generation two. This is divinely time. This is a gift. You deserve this. You deserve this. I'm here to stay optimistic about your love life. Where's my coming to America, please? Make the effort. Okay. Great love is worth taking the step. You're guided to take care. I, mm, mm. I can't make this. I literally just said I heard. Stay open. Stop the assistant to your love. I say open. You know, you just never know. It may be a different type of love than you know. I mean, you can probably know more used to like bad boys or something like that you know you may get the opposite of that you may get somebody that's like ooh. or maybe you're used to ooh. you may get somebody that's more dominated you know the opposite of what you're normally used to is what i'm hearing so you won't recognize this person coming to you at all it's truly going to be divine timing it's truly truly going to be discovering each other that's what's up. That's beautiful. Do you know what type of love story that is? Like, y'all from two totally different worlds, okay? Now, look, look, look. Overseas is on here. So, y'all from two totally different worlds, two totally different environments, and y'all gonna meet up at some point in some middle, and y'all gonna, you know, when two become one. And I don't mean that on no sexual base. It ain't always about sex. This person is is well off, and they come in here in disguise. You feel me? But they come in here on a whole different mission for some of y'all. They come in here to sell their raw oats to get it on with as much people as they can. Can I say, you not in 2022, all these no, ill, but okay, five foot three two one. But they're gonna come across you. They're gonna think they're gonna come over here to saw they roll oats and they're gonna run into you and they life is gonna change for the better. They ain't even gonna try to look no other way. It's gonna be you and you alone. Yeah, it's gonna be like a familiar, like you know this person from somewhere from um, far, maybe a past life or something. I'm getting past life energy. <laughs> this is beautiful. Yeah. Spirit wants you to be quiet as a mouse too. Yeah. Living La Boca, my crazy life. If so for what I'm picking up is for a long time, for a lot of y'all, y'all lived out loud, you know, with your love life. So I'm here with your love life. You want to, you know, probably tone it down and just get to know each other, you know, whether you're in union now or when you're destined to be in union later on. You really want to get in tune with each other. You don't need the outside chattery to be all up in your energy field. You know, you just need to focus on one another because y'all too also has a mission that you have to obtain together. So y'all got a job too. 
Yeah, y'all gonna be building together. I don't know what it is, but I'm hearing y'all gonna be building something great and y'all gonna be very victorious of it. Yeah. With this emperor here? What? And he well off and able to? She. Y'all about to build some shit that's gonna be generational because generation came out here twice. So it's gonna be epic. Okay, this is destined to happen. Y'all gonna be building some type of generation wealth together that's gonna save, I was gonna say change the world, but for some of y'all, it's gonna save the world. I mean that. When it do, remember I said it here first. Yeah. This conflict I'm hearing gonna be a thing of the past. These energy they gonna be out here for a Texas is their teacher lesson. A lot of them gonna die. They don't have no soul. I got no soul. I got no soul. Your, your lifespan is shorter than it would have been if you would have stayed around and stuck with the most high. Which give you know like what well, it makes sense to gain all the riches. But to leave, lose your soul really makes sense, yo. Like, you don't have your soul, you really can't enjoy them riches. Because at any given moment, the devil likes this trickery energy. Okay, I gave you that for 2.6 seconds, and now it's time for me to take it back. Like, what? Huh? Yeah. And on top of that, I need your blood. But if you want to keep it on there, like, I don't know, maybe one or two 